Welcome back to another episode of Casey Campbell's video cast. Casey Campbell here with Great Lakes Close. We are now here with Ron Patrick from Canton Football uh, after a big win against Heartland. How's it going? Good. How are you doing? Doing good, man. Um, you guys have been putting them up, picking them up, and putting them down this year in the KLA West. Um, what what has this season been like for you guys? And you know, I I know last year was not the way that you um, not the way that you wanted it to go but it looks like this year even though there's only six games in the season it's been working out pretty well for you yeah I think last season was just a big eye-opener for our senior leaders and I think this year we were able to take the next big step and just really feel like this is our last football games like we don't want to go out the way we did last year we don't want to see what happened to our seniors happen again so we want to do everything we can to keep playing football <laughs> yeah um, what's been the biggest difference this year with this team? Uh, I think our coaches have taken a massive step in our schemes, and they're really opening up and letting our personnel go to work. Like, you see us going to spread here sometimes, John Levine going on the deep ball, or on we're doing our shifts now on defense. Like, it's really working out. And the more they open it up, the better we're doing because we were loaded with smart kids. Yeah. Um. You know, I know this defense is – I know Canton's known for its wing T offense, but the defense has been actually pretty strong, you know, this year. What, what's uh, – talk about some of the guys around you that just make it so, so – I mean, you got you got freshman sensation Caleb Williams locking up their number one receiver every single play and getting questionable calls here and there. But, I mean, that's, that's not too much to be said. But uh, then you got Jack Vespi, returning starter, very good – very strong leadership role with the DBs. He's given all the right calls this year. And then, like I said earlier, uh, Ada Tafelski, my new quick linebacker, he's very smart, making the right calls when I mess up, making up for my mistakes. Uh, and our D-line, of course, holding it down, too, pretty solid with all the drives given back from our explosive offense. So. Yeah. Well, yeah, just kind of, you know, of course uh, – if I'm not mistaken, you have a park game next week, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, Plymouth. Um, anytime those two teams, anytime, the, you know, either Canton, Plymouth, or Salem get together, um, it's always going to be a battle. You didn't yeah. win the park last year. Um, what's it going to take to get it done this year? Because you can do it this year. Uh, I don't think there's any doubt in any one of our minds that we're going to win this game. Uh, I think we just need to listen to the coaches, trust our scheme, and it's going to look, if not worse than the other games we've played. Yeah. I think our team is only getting better, and it's it's going to get scary for teams coming up against us. And I just think that's the attitude. There's no other there's no other way to feel at this point. Yeah. Well, Ron, thank you so much. Um, uh, congratulations on the big win against yeah. Heartland, and. Uh, Good luck this this next coming week as we wrap up the season um, against Plymouth. Yes, sir. Thank you for having me. Loved it.